Okay, so I've had to go through some, or I've been going through some old pictures lately, and um, I didn't realize I had a bunch of my before before pictures on my phone, so I'm gonna string a few together. Hi, new subscribers. When I wave, you'll see lots of these tally marks. Um, and Darlene, <laughs> Darlene, I wrote your name on my hand so that I'm sure to add you to the list of Octobers. So um, anyways, the tally marks are explained in my video called How I Stop Myself From Binging. This is a strategy. So um, hi, new subscribers. Um, my name is Emily. I'm a faithful follower of Jesus Christ. I am addicted to sugar, flour, and binging. I have a bachelor's degree in special education and actually I'm dual certified um, in special ed and regular ed. And um, I could teach with that, I could teach K through five regular education and K through 12 special education. Um, I taught special education for five years and went on maternity leave after kid number four and never went back and had kid number five. Um, somewhere in there, I got my master's degree in administration, which would allow me to be a principal of a school. Um, I have no intention of going back into the school system. I am now happily momming and farming and um, doing everything I can to keep this ship sailing in the right direction around here. So um, I have been a stay at home mom um, for seven years now. but. Um, with a bachelor's in special education, that's all behavior, and a master's in administration, which is leadership, I consider myself qualified to lead behavior. And um, the behavior I aim to lead daily is my own. And that is a good part of what this channel is all about. Me just showing you guys how I'm navigating this human experience because um, we are spirits, we are in bodies, and we have souls. So I like to tell people, you are not fat because you are not your body. Um, we become what we believe we are. When I believed I was fat, I got fatter. When I realized I was Emily, I got emily -er. It's really healthy to disconnect um, ourselves from our bodies. That's like saying, um, you know, say there was some man in a blue truck that man is not blue. His truck is blue. So um, these bodies we're in, they are um, getting, they're aging. We're not aging, we are eternal beings. These bodies we're in are aging and we're gonna deal with all sorts of stuff including addiction and mental health issues and diseases and diabetes and cancer and the list goes on and on and on and on and on. Like Paul talks about, we have thorns in our flesh and um, if we can keep this healthy perspective that we are not our bodies, we are in them, um, then we can keep shame at bay because um, I feel zero shame for any afflictions that my body has. Um, however, I wanna take really excellent care of this vehicle I'm in so I can serve the Lord uh, in a way that honors and pleases Him. So there's all that. Without further ado, here's a bunch of pictures of me. I call them before and during because the way I see it, um, there is no after pictures of our bodies until, until the end. <laughs> because for one thing, I'm not even at my goal weight, so I'm not gonna call these before and after. These are before and during. But trust me, even when I get to my goal weight, when I get to my goal weight, then I wanna I want to build some muscle. So um, I don't plan to ever be done. I don't plan to ever have an after picture. Um, all right, let me show you what I got in front of me right now. Three dogs and one kid. So in my little intro there, I guess I failed to mention, I have five kids and yeah, I did, I did say that. And we have four dogs and um, cattle. We cattle farm. My husband is a cattle broker and we raise and sell Charley bulls. So somewhere in our October adventure, you will see our, um, I'm sure I'll show you little bits of our annual bull sale. So if anybody needs a bull, let me know in the comments. Okay. Here's some pictures of my before and during, and these I think go back. I've got loads of pictures. 
um, somewhere digital, right? Digital data somewhere. But this is what I have handy right now. And these go back as far as I think um, 15 years ago, 10 years ago, I, um, I weighed about what I weigh now at my wedding. And then my husband and I both gained about a hundred pounds getting through school and newborn babies. And, um, my, my experience with addiction is not using substances to numb or run from painful experiences. I literally used them to get through a lot of life, a lot of, a lot of good things. I used sugar and flour to um, help me and force me to keep going and going and going as an upper. So, um, and then I'm sure that somewhere in there, I also used it to manage and just sort of stuff down negative emotions like overwhelm. <laughs> There's been some of that in the past 20 years. Okay, so here we go. Here's some pictures. Um, that's it. Nice to meet you guys. I'm Emily. It's starting to feel like fall. Happy September. Join us in October if you want. Um, uh, officially, and I'll put you on the list so that your name can be on there. I'll put the name, the names on there in each um, video each night. And then we can all be praying for each other by name. That's it. I should add, I um, joined Brightline Eating on October 24th, 2019. Um, I've lost 80 something pounds since then. At one point I had, I had lost 100, but I relapsed. So I'm around 90, I'm down 90 or so, somewhere in there. October 24th, 2019. So when you see the picture of me in the gray tank top, that was the night before I ate my first bright meal.